YouTube, what's good? It's your boy, Mr. Blackhorn, with another video. And uh, of course, got the Blackhorn behind me. And guess what, guys? I finally got me some brake caliper covers to go over these, oof, these atrocious looking brake calipers. Let me show you. As you guys can see, my calipers are, you know, they were chipping real bad. Um, so, yep, had to get some brake caliper covers for those. And uh, pretty excited about it because they look really good. Um, so, these are the back ones. So, just want to show you guys like a quick before and after. Hmm. See, I got some kind of, what is this? oxidation or something on the center cap we gotta check that out but anyway let me show you what the brake caliper covers look like all right so they're made by mgp and i actually had the opportunity to get them like custom engraved and all that kind of good stuff but uh i don't know i didn't i didn't i it would have looked pretty cool to see black horn spelled out in my calipers as the wheels were spinning but i i just kind of feel like i don't want to do too much you know too much accenting on this truck i mean the YouTube sticker is like, you know, black and white and, and uh, I don't know, I just didn't want to have too many things sticking out. So I just went with a solid black uh, cover, uh, something nice and neat and clean. So these are the calipers. I haven't pulled them out yet. So Nice black powder coated. That's, I mean, that's gonna look real nice in there. Matches the truck, right? So we got this one. This is the back. This is what the back one's gonna look like. And of course, we got the front one, which is much bigger, but those are the front ones so and you see those that clip right well, if i can get it to focus that little bolt right there is it fastens to the clips that came with it so i'll show you guys what it looks like when i'm finished also guys just for the sake of you know you guys knowing what to do if you do decide to order these they're going to come already pre-packaged so the you see the rear clips are all together in one little baggie and then the front clips are all together in, in that one and they kind of staple, staple the little bags together. So there's no way you can get it mixed up, all right? Also, also guys, it comes with a set of um, directions, uh, like a quick installation guide. So yeah, again, very simple installation. I've watched a couple of videos on it and um, pretty simple installation uh yeah i'm thinking that uh i'm i'm gonna install these without taking my wheels off because of course i got plenty of room to <laughs> because of my wheels i got plenty of room to stick my hands in there and get it installed and screw down the clips without any issues so stay tuned So guys, pretty much what I needed was a 10 millimeter socket to get those clips tightened up. So yep, that should do the trick. All right guys, so uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this uh, clip, which is the rear clip. And first you wanna take this bolt off because you'll screw this on later on. All right, then we're gonna take it here we're gonna clip it right behind where that rotor is. Uh, kind of work it down into there real good. Now that's where it's gonna fit. Now, of course, we gotta make sure that there, that it's not touching the rotor. So I wanna work it in there a little bit better to make sure that it's not touching because you gotta have a space 
in between the clip and the rotor. All right, guys, so I got the clip on there. And one of the reasons that they also send you this uh, card is to kind of test out just to make sure that it's passing through without any issues, without touching. So as you can see, I'm not having any issues. Nothing's touching. I can freely move the card back and forth between there. So it's just showing that it's plenty of space for that rotor to turn. And then the same thing is gonna happen underneath the bottom. All right, guys, so you can see that this is the top of the brake caliper. This is the bottom. So we're gonna do the same thing. Just make sure you take the nut off and we're gonna find that space right up in here to work it in and make sure that it's not touching. And then we wanna test it out real quick just to make sure that we got space in between here. So see plenty of space, no touching. Uh, if it was touching, then I wouldn't be able to put, you know, push the card in between there. So we're good on that. All right, guys, what we're gonna do next is we're gonna take the brake caliper cover and get it in here. And then I'll basically, you gotta see, gonna sit it on top of there, right? And then come down here and kind of pop it into place there. And we're good to go. So now it's just a matter of putting the bolts on the top, fastening them up, and then twerking it down with the 10 millimeter socket uh, that I have. So you guys stay tuned. All right, guys. So with the front, uh, front is a little bit bigger. With these, you don't have to take the the nuts all the way off. Um, you just unscrew them a little bit because the clips are slightly different. The back ones, the the uh, it's set all the way on to the clip, but these you, you actually put these in place and then slide these on, and so they can slide around the clip like so. So we're gonna go ahead and put these in place, and these should be actually a little bit quicker and easier to put on. So the biggest thing with the front ones is you want to put the brake caliper cover in place and then you'll slide that clip over and it'll sit right uh, on top of that rotor, like not literally on top of it, but it'll go on the top of it, slide it into place and then you tighten uh, the nut down after you get it in place. All right guys, and after getting everything in place, getting it tightened up uh, in both places, Everything looks uh, looks nice and snug. So yeah, looking good. All right, YouTube, we got them installed. I think that looks a heck of a lot better. I'm gonna have to do something later on to maybe make those little chrome bolts black or something like that. But for now, I'm good. And I'm very pleased with how they came out look real nice so yep so there you go MGP uh, brake caliper covers definitely worth it I think I only paid like 240 bucks for just the plane uh, without the, the buttons and the engravings on them so definitely worth it wasn't, wasn't a bad install at all very simple so uh guys hey just a little little something something extra y'all know i'm trying to keep y'all tuned in uh i got a car show coming up april 1st and uh there is a giveaway going on right now with the truck bed cover so you guys continue to enter that giveaway will be going on to march 25th uh until the next episode you guys stay blessed peace